She was either a member of the Partridge family or the Brady Bunch. I don't remember which one. Either way, today we're making... Strawberry Shortcake! Strawberry Shortcake. These are the ingredients. We didn't forget you guys Sunday. We were really busy. Christine and Josh got married. Congratulations to you guys. And it was Mother's Day. So we're also spending it with our mothers. So we're back. We didn't forget you guys. It's woo Wednesday. And today, the request of Chef Little Billy, we're going to make some strawberry shortcake. So let's get into this. And a quick disclaimer before we start. For those of you who know, who know about the Italian sausage incident the other day, that was not an official Chef Big Billy incident. That was a Kevin Thibdo incident. We're not, you know, those things came out looking like bear crap because they caught the grill on fire. That's not going to happen today. We're going to make the best strawberry shortcake there is around because we're still not at work. So this is what we're going to do. We're going to take this bowl, slap it on here. Heart, take the sugar okay. and the butter. Okay, I'm gonna take the butter. We're gonna put it in the bowl and we're gonna cream it. So it's gonna mix together and look pretty cool. Sugar. Hang on to it. Butter. Now, safety first, kids. We're gonna mix that so that's mixed together nice. Gonna have a light yellow to it. Then we're gonna add in our egg and our vanilla. Then we're gonna mix it well. All right, looks good. Heart, vanilla. Now we're going to mix it. Alright, now that these are well creamed like everybody's spirits when the tax bill comes in, we're going to add our dry ingredients. Heart? What? Tell them about our dry ingredients. Now we're going to whisk. Now we're going to whisk! What are we whisking? The dry ingredients. Which are? The flour. And? The salt. And the? adding those. She's going to whisk them together so you don't have any little pockets of baking powder. And then we're going to mix it in slowly with a little bit of milk at the same time. Half, 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 half. Okay, Alright, Harp. Power whisk. Don't make a mess. Okay, don't mess up your Gidget shirt. Very proud of her Gidget shirt. She just wants you guys to know. I don't know, all the ingredients are white. I think so. Alright. Let me give it a little test run. Alright, now we're going to crank this bad boy on. Pull it in. Down. There you go. Thank you. If anybody tries to steal our stuff, just heat it in the face with that. Alright, a little bit of dry ingredients. A little bit of milk. A little bit of dry ingredients. A little bit more milk. And once again, if you saw our previous videos, the mixture works better in the bowl and not the motor of the machine. Take this mixture, pour it out of this bowl. Harp, now that you're done picking your nose, you can help me. Okay. Get your trusty out. Yep. 
No. <laughs> so we're going to bake this for 350 degrees for 20, 25 minutes. 20, 25 minutes. If it ever comes out of this bowl, what the heck? Yeah. This is like what you were digging for in your nose before mom started the camera. Oh, God. Yeah. You're getting it on my bare fur. Watch out. Okay. Let's. All right, watch out. Yeah, it's professional here. This stuff is not coming out. If you ever need the drywall, this is the perfect mixture. A little tape, a little bit of this flour, sugar, vanilla mixture. Be ready for paint in a half hour. Boy, this is gross. Plus yummy. Sure. That's what you're into. All right. Gonna mix it around a little bit so it's kind of even in the pan here, which we pre-floured. Pre-floured beforehand. We don't want to bore you guys with a 15-minute video of me yakking. Nobody wants to hear that. We know why you're all here. Harper and the food. All right, we're all done. Ready to pop it in the oven. You ready to pop it in the oven? Yep. All right, here, let's wipe off your mini trusty. <laughs> all right, in the oven it goes. Bottom shelf, so I don't get yelled at this time. Got yelled at like the past four videos we're putting on the top shelf. We tell you guys 20, 25 minutes. We really got to cut and bake it for like 45. So that ain't happening again. Bottom shelf. Bottom shelf productions is on. 20, 25 minutes, we'll see you. All right, so now we're going to make some whipped cream using some a cup of heavy... There's a lady staring at me in a window walking her fluffy dog with the same pants she's been wearing for the last five days. Chef Big Belly on YouTube. Like, share, and subscribe. And until then... Mind your business! That's right, mind your business. So now we're going to take a cup of heavy whipping cream. Now she's trotting away. Heavy whipping cream. One cup. I'm going to throw it in here. And we're going to turn it on and blend it until we get stiff peaks. Not twin peaks, stiff peaks. Load explode. Turn it up. So now, stiff peaks. So we're going to add in our vanilla and confectioner's sugar. Yes. Uh -huh. You thought I forgot. I didn't. I really did, but I didn't. So once we get our stiff peaks up, you're going to add these and we're going to blend it again, alright? Okay. Okay. Now we got our stiff peaks. Yeah, what's in it? <laughs> Pour the vanilla in the bowl. Okay. That's not the vanilla. <laughs> oh. No, what's in it? Now take the confectioner's sugar and powder and put it in the bowl. Okay. You what's in it? That was a horrible <laughs> rendition. You what's in it? Now we turn the mixer on. <laughs> now we're mixing all our stuff. I don't know who will remember that song. I had no idea what it was until about 25 seconds ago. If you know it, bonus points for you. If you don't, yeah. You didn't mess with it. You <laughs> Okay, now that our cake's out of the oven, and we got our whipped cream made. It's time for the next step. We're gonna add our strawberries. And then hey, we- Hey, hey, time for you to break. Oh, perfect. We've been waiting all day for this. One for you. Yeah. One for me. Cheers. Oh. Now that our cake is cooled and out of the oven, you gotta cut it horizontally, vertically, diagonally, any which way you get. So you get four. Equal sandwich looking pieces. We only need two, so we're going to take these two, put them to the side. Got our fresh cut strawberries for Harbor here. Okay. And we got our whipped cream. You can use all different kinds of berries aside in yours. My mother in law likes to use lemon pudding. Hey, whatever. We don't judge here, we just eat. So, Harper, here's yours. Okay, cool. Take some strawberries, put them on there. 
Okay. Give you a little bit of that whipped cream goodness. Done. You want to add any more strawberries on it? I'm sure. We're done. And we're going to put some on top too, so don't put a lot. Okay. Okay, perfect. Just a little bit more on top. And now put some strawberries. Wait, wait, I got one for the I got one for the top. What's the look? What do you mean what's the look? Dig in, kid. Okay. You gonna stab somebody? Who told you to hold the fork like that? No way! Alright, I'll just eat it. Let us know how it is. Here. I'll feed you. I'll show you how you should be treated by a man someday. And if not, you're dead. There you go, Harp. <laughs> you angry at the strawberry shortcake? You gangbanging on whipped cream? What's the matter? Is it good? Yep. Thanks for watching. Like, share, and subscribe. Chef Big Belly on YouTube. We'll see you guys next week. Another episode of Quarantine Cooking with Kevin. I'm Chef Big Belly. And I'm Thanks for watching. I'm going to finish this. This is delicious. Bye. Bye.